Hello friends, it's time for another little video and this time we are getting low. So it's about how to help your horse lowering the head while riding. So let's get on with it. So now I'm up here and it's time for us to go forward and lower the head. So the reason we want our horse to lower the head is to get him in a more relaxed body position to where the, all the happy drugs, the chemicals, the hormones like endorphins and stuff like that can start flowing more easily through the body. Another reason is also we want him to stretch his top line to make it really long and round so that he doesn't get, let me see if I can, I can do this, uh, get up the head so he doesn't get like a curved Body, uh, body shape, but that he actually gets a long body shape. So I'll just do this. I'll go forward first and just following the, the fence here. Now he's a little, you can see he's very aware of the little tiny cow I have over here. That's because that's his main job to work with cattle and cows. So we don't want to do that today. I'm telling him we don't want to do that right now. We want to get the head down and relax. So he got a little tense there. He said, oh, is it work time? So he was starting to tense up a little bit and, and get uh, excited and ready. So first of all, I'm just walking forward. You can see he's looking up, he's looking around, but the head is kind of medium. I want it to be low. So what I'll do is I'll take my reins here and then I'm just going to take kind of a hold of the bit in the mouth. And this is where it's important. So I'm holding the bit in the mouth and I'm taking it a little bit there. He started to seek down uh, and also a little bit in. So he went away from the bit, and, but then he also went down. So I have here a snaffle bit, which is great for encouraging the horse to, to kind of go a little bit against it, but then move to the sides, but go a little bit against the bit there. So what we want him is to kind of go against it, hold the bit in the mouth and, um, and kind of just seek down like that. That is what we want. So let's do this again. Let's take it and hold it there. That's the kind of thing we want. So you can see the body shape he's getting when he's doing that is really good. Take a little bit of contact but we're still walking forward there. Even a blowout was good. So then I'll do something else. I'm going forward here, and then I'm just gonna kind of massage the reins to kind of have a light pressure, but all the time to really encourage down and forward, really encourage down and forward like this, and really look at his body shape when he goes down like this, like really, See, he stretches this top line. He's still driving forward with his hind feet, but he's relaxing more and more. This is a great and healthy frame for a horse to be in, both in the walk, but also, let's see, I, I ask him to go down like this, and then I just ask him to gently go up into the trot, like this, but then keep the frame going. So I'm just massaging the reins here to help him understand that it's about going down while trotting so he also gets that body frame in the trot really stretching down going down like this that's the whole point of it now we're getting all the benefits of the body shape the stretching of the top line he has to use his butt muscles his belly muscles to to do it really to get forward while stretching down but it's also good because it helps him to relax more just because of the physical position uh, it, of course it doesn't work when you have a very nervous very fearful or tense horse but i would say you should you shouldn't even ride those kind of horses you should work on the ground to get them relaxed but it works with horses that are just everyday horses that needs more relaxation and needs a better body position or body form or shape then this is a great exercise and use a snaffle like with rings on the side and and preferably one that is a three-piece mouthpiece because then it doesn't go like this up in the head in the roof of the mouth but then it kind of just encourage the horse to kind of go a little bit against 
the bit. So let me see here. So I'll just take it out and just hold it. See if he can encourage him to seek down like this while standing still as well. That's also super great to get the horse seeking down and really relaxing. So now it's time for you to go out and get low with your horse. Get low, be a low rider, you know? You've seen the Gone in 60 Seconds, the song, be a low rider, that's what we wanna do here. So otherwise, don't forget, like and subscribe, and we'll see you on the next video. So go out, do your best, get low, and make a difference for your horse.